At Delaware County Christian School, we've watched generation after generation grow up before our eyes. Our mission is to educate students who will serve God and impact the world through biblical thought and action. It's a very special place where loving the Lord and getting a great education go hand in hand. We're constantly challenged to improve in our teaching and to constantly find better ways to do our job to teach our students and to grow in the Lord. There is no ordinary student here. We believe every student is created in the image of God and is special and unique. And that belief is more than just words. We really uh, act on that belief. We have the freedom here at D.C. to be able to integrate everything we do, um, filter it through the glasses of God's Word and see what He has to think about that. So it really does become part of their everyday um, experience. And biblical thinking is not just, uh, it's not just rote memorization of the right answers. Biblical thinking is really developing a biblical worldview, a biblical lens by which to view the world. Here at the elementary school, we want to give them a good foundation and help them, train them, uh, help them to be all that they can be so that they truly can make the most of those gifts that God has endowed them with. We have students who are very gifted in mathematics and we need to challenge them. We need to develop the extent of their gift. And we do that through an accelerated program that starts them in algebra in middle school and takes them all the way up through the advanced placement calculus program. Our reading program is based on teaching kids how to think critically while they read. They teach them to think specific questions so that they'll be able to understand the author's intended message. A student that would be interested in English should be able to take our science program at a general level that would be applicable to what they're doing. Uh, we also have the high level where the scientist, the person who's going to be majoring in a science, will uh, have any program they need. We work very hard, very intentionally, from kindergarten through high school in developing critical and analytical thinking skills. We aim to make our uh, curriculum developmentally appropriate, um, plan strategic activities and lessons that will uh, meet the need of an early learner, a lot of hands-on activities, a lot of discovery kind of learning, giving them real life applications to what it is that they're learning and relating it to their little six, seven or eight year old minds. We believe that the scriptures really give parents the responsibility to train and educate children. What we are doing is partnering with Christian parents to assist them in the full development of their children. My husband and I have five children, two presently at D.C., and we appreciate the partnership that we have with the teachers and the staff at D.C. They encourage us as parents to raise godly children, and we appreciate what they do in the classroom to incorporate Christ into the curriculum. The way the students develop uh, over the time that I'm able to have them from middle school through high school uh, is just a blessing to be able to see how they mature, and as they mature, their level of performance and confidence grows also. The DC curriculum uh, for the fine arts is a sequential and a step-by-step -step process. We started in the pre-K program and it's an integral part of the core curriculum through middle school and then becomes an elective in high school. There's just so many reasons why you'd want to come here. The theater department is wonderful. The concert choir and night tones are just great. And um, we have things like student senate, Habitat for Humanity, just like a plethora of opportunities, um, as well as a really supportive and encouraging staff. I really feel that there's something for everyone here. It's not just an athletic school or a drama school. It's for everyone. Anyone can find a place that they'll feel comfortable and fit in. I'm really involved in athletics here, and it's just fun to play with your friends and grow close to the Lord through athletics and have coaches that really care about you as a person and your development as a person more than just your level of talent on the field. Ninety-five to ninety-eight percent of our kids go on to college each year. 
but we do believe in a, a range of academic diversity here. We have students who need some extra support to succeed academically, and we provide that for them. But we also have some very gifted and capable students who uh, matriculate at top tier universities. This year has been my most challenging year academically as a senior, having taken four AP classes. I'm going to attend the University of Virginia next year. I want to be an actress. And so we are committed to working with a range of students to ensure their academic success. There are several core values that shape who we are as an institution. The first is the idea of being rooted in Christ. But secondly is the idea of no ordinary student, that every student is created in the image of God. A third value is something we refer to as authentic servanthood. Jesus Christ is the ultimate example of a servant leader who gave himself for others. The fourth one is the idea of raising the bar, that we believe in corporate excellence and individual excellence for individual students. A uh, fifth value is the idea of team building. Students need to learn to work in teams, and we as leaders at the school need to work in teams. And then the last one is the idea of parent partnership, that we are committed to partnering with parents in the education of their children. As a parent, you want the very best for your child, and the very best is not just, in our view, academic success or uh, the accumulation of wealth, uh, the very best for your child is to shape your child in how your child is going to think and act in the world. And a biblical way of thinking, a biblical worldview is really priceless. And we are committed to partnering with you to really fully develop the gifts of your child in being all that he or she can be.